Now, in the past five years, more than 100,000 of people have crossed the English Channel on small boats from France to Britain. And in a recent incident, six Afghan men have died. That is after a boat carrying migrants en route to England sank in the Channel. The Channel between France and Britain is one of the world's busiest shipping lanes. This lane encounters strong currents, making the crossing on small boats extremely dangerous. France's government is blaming human traffickers who provoke people to get on board and face severe conditions to cross the Atlantic Ocean and then migrate to England. If we mourn six victims today, it is the fault of traffickers, criminals who send young people, women, adults to their death through these maritime routes which are dangerous and deadly. I'm here with the Mayor of Calais, the State Services and the Secretary General for the Sea to first of all express our deep thoughts for the families of the victims, their loved ones, and then also to be at the side of the survivors who are supported by the State Services to help them, accompany them after what has undoubtedly been a lot of trauma. Well, the French authorities have claimed that 60 migrants have been rescued. The search for the missing passenger is still on. A UK border force vessel and two lifeboats rescued passengers on another small boat in the channel. This comes at the backdrop of UK Prime Minister Rishi Sunak's government announcement to reduce the number of asylum seekers arriving on small boats. This year alone, the number of migrants crossing the channel stands at 16,000 with over a thousand arrivals in the past one week.